Hey there, guys. Hey. Welcome to Screen Source. It's your favorite show on Color Circuit. We're going to be reacting to a whole bunch of trailers for you. We got the gr the gang all here. Charles. Dylan. Sarah. That's right. My arm popped just now. And you now. are. My name is not important right now, guys. Let's just... Thank you. Thank you. Uh, we're going to be reacting. Uh, you, you clearly clicked on this, knowing what side of this versus you're on. We got Teen Titans Go!, Versus Teen Titans, and and for those who don't know, Teen Titans was a show in the early two thousands directed towards like preteens okay. that got that you know developed a following. Everybody loves Teen Titans because yeah. it had that fun, catchy Japanese song. It was kind of like anime. It was a little bit serious with a little bit of action, and then the show went away for a while, mm -hmm. and everyone was like. Where's Teen Titans? Where's Teen Titans? Where did it go? Where did it go, guys? And then Cartoon Network brought it back, but they changed it into <laughs> a bad thing. A just awful, dumb, stupid comedy show for little kids that floss unironically. I can't do it. Oh, this uh, thing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then they made a movie. Teen Titans go to the movies. And I saw that, and it was stupid. Uh, so they're making a second film now to appease mm. those people who miss the old show while reminding them that this is the hell they live in now. Okay. So let's watch Teen Titans Go versus Teen Titans. Welcome to my arena. Oh, cool. Face your challenges. They're the serious versions of us! Just what we need to kick us up a notch! Let's prove we're the best Titans in the multiverse! <laughs> so, I think I know who's behind this. <laughs> Hi there. Chargers! That's right! We will conquer the multiverse together, and there's nothing you can do to stop us! We are in the danger. It is time for the cooperation! Oh, come on! Uh. Oh, wow, yay, we're all besties now! Night. What took you so long? Santa <laughs> Claus. He's right there. <laughs> Is this good or bad? The cost of being a hero. Brooding heroes. Their Robin is so handsome. <laughs> They go straight to Blu-ray. That's where yeah. they go. Uh, this does not get a theatrical release. <laughs> Fuck you. Well, this seems like a good place for me to jump on since I don't know much about either of the shows. Yeah. Do you have Oh, a... you mean start like literally? Yeah, I'll jump yeah. on to this. Yeah, You're jump on to the... You're going to work backwards? No. No, I'll just watch this and be satisfied. Yeah. I'll, I'll learn everything I need to. I actually like the trailer. Yeah. I thought it was fun. Yeah. 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 So anyway, anyway. Uh, in uh, in Teen Titans Go to the Movies, which luckily I watched, so I am ready. I have researched this movie. There's a mid credit scene that brings back the original Teen Titans saying that they found a way back to the world or something like that uh, as, a, as a sort of – because people miss – People miss the original Teen Titans show. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Teen Titans to call Teen Titans Go a slap into the face to the original fans of the show is like an understatement. You go from this semi-serious kids cartoon to this this stupid random humor yeet fest that is Teen Titans Go. I it's, just found out what yeet means. It, what, I, is, what is what is don't spoil yeah. it? Don't spoil I think it. It means to me. like to 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 like throw away. Yeah. 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 So, very appropriate for Teen Titans Go. <laughs> uh, so I think Teen Titans Go is 
struggled to find like to be taken seriously mm. as a as a serviceable cartoon. I so I think I'm gonna bounce off of that. All right. Can you hear me by the way? Yeah. The, is it fixed now? Okay. Um we'll edit that out in post. Uh, <laughs> <just kidding. laughs> we don't do post. <laughs> <laughs> We're late. What the fuck do you think you are? <laughs> <laughs> um okay anyway, uh I think Teen Titans Go is for children and that's it. Like like it doesn't have any kind of deep profound things it's it. for your nephew yeah it's for my nephew it's for like kids it's lost and like love Fortnite. yeah <laughs> but like teen titans is like it has me like deep meaning yeah therefore like i don't think that like teen titans go is a complete like disaster because i'm sure like little kids watch this is it for and you and your nephew to watch enjoy together enjoy it i would love to i would love to because i i loved teen titans i loved teen titans like if I was a different child, I probably would have like grown up like cosplaying Teen Titans, but I'm not like that, so I won't. But uh, <laughs> did you say won't? I won't. Uh, that H there is silent. Yeah, I yeah. pronounce it. You've been saying it wrong this whole time. I didn't know that. Just like yeet. Won't. Welcome. Welcome. Uh, but I, what an embarrassing tell, way to learn that. Yeah, yeet. <laughs> You could tell, like, even the, like, style of the Teen Titans are a little different from what, like, we know them Original, to be. Yeah. yeah. yeah the this original. is clearly in the favor of Teen Titans yeah. Go. This is just so you will go see it. Yeah, and I will. On what? I'll rent it on Redbox. Okay, all right, all right. This is a Redbox movie for you? This is a Redbox movie for me. It'll probably be on streaming not too So, yeah. you two, well, yeah, DC. So, I've seen a little bit of Go, and that's it. <laughs> And I think it's like cute. Like I think they're funny. I really like the uh, trailer because the last time I'd heard of Teen Titans Go was the movie that dropped. That wasn't that long ago. No, no. it's not. Uh, and that trailer was really good. At least I thought so. I think, I it, think the movie it, did it's it's exactly well. when I say it's stupid. As much as like I mean it as an insult, that's what it was intended to be. Sure, it's yeah. just not. For, it's it wasn't for me. Sure. I'm like I am too old mentally for this kind of bullshit. Sure, sure. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. need something with, uh, with a little deeper meaning. Yeah, Jackass 3D. <laughs> okay. I want my comedy mature and and with a a porta potty okay. being bungeed up into the sky. With Britney Spears in it. No, with Steve O. Okay. Have you, seen, have you not seen the masterpiece? Yeah, I have, but, but Britney Spears ends up, in, I think, in a deleted scene doing the same thing with a bunch of shit all over her, and she didn't know it was. For the third one? Yeah. I think that's the one I didn't oh, watch. I'm going to have to tell you guys right now that that is not true at all. What? Did yeah. I make that up? Yeah, you made that up. Do oh. you not know? Did, you don't even know that she's in the movie. She's I not in the it. movie. I will show you. Pull up the trailer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, your Teen Titans go. Anyway, Teen yeah, yeah. Titans. I don't think this uh, movie. I'm not the demographic for this movie no. because I was older than even when the original cartoon came out. I was See, already I in my even, 20s. Yeah, I wasn't even into the like watching the original show. It was like a half hour show, and it felt like it took an hour to watch. Oh, okay. I was not into it. Wow. I'm sorry, I was not into You're it. Such a hater. No. I loved Cartoon Network though. Like I love Teen Titans and I love like Code Lyoko. And yeah. those were my jam. See, I think with like Teen Titans, it was I was like getting out of that phase where yeah. I was like I was all about cartoons. It's when I started getting really into Lost. You see, I think I'm the youngest <laughs> one here, so I feel like this is like yeah yeah this yeah, is yeah. Like this would yeah, yeah yeah and anime like that's when like real anime was like like peaking my interest so while teen titans was going around i was like i'm gonna watch but see i like characterize like teen titans the same way like avatar the last airbender yeah and like Coke anime Lego. influence people yeah, yeah people there, this is a cult following mm -hmm. uh i'm like, part of that cult yeah maybe i will cosplay it one day what are you who are you gonna cosplay as Probably Raven. Yeah. Mm. Who else? She's a bad bitch. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. like not optimistic enough to be Starfire. Mm. That's true. Mm. Yeah, I can she see is that. She's not optimistic that enough to be yeah. Starfire. <laughs> 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 I concur. I I do want to see this though. Like I said, this would probably be a good jumping on point, or just to watch this one thing. Yeah, I kind of want to see it too. It. it seems like you will la you. It will get a chuckle out of you. Yeah. Like, <laughs> well, it already I the like, trailer did. I like what they did with the with the villain, and they made the they also put the second villain in. There. Yeah, they didn't yeah. choose one, and like yeah, they're just doing it all double everything up. Yeah, double everything up, yeah. which is good. I like the dynamics between the two Robins. I liked the scene where the the Robin is probably Teen Titan Go. Teen Robin Titans was. Go. Robin is probably like the best part of Teen Titans Go. He was the best part of that movie. Mm, he's he was, good. Yeah, okay. Funny. I enjoyed him. I enjoyed his stuff in that yeah. movie. But when they started like rapping, I was like, and you. Or when they were doing like EDM, like DJing. That was kind yeah. of funny. That was like that got me. Like so, if a movie if a movie goes long enough without a laugh, 
it'll be like the stupidest thing that I'm like, all right, movie. Like <laughs> I see what you did there. Like breaks the, Ralph breaks the internet got me with uh, Open Sesame's mm. whole movie, no laughter, and then Open Sesame's I'm like, all right, <laughs> <laughs> you got it. Do we guys think of Spider Man because they mentioned multiverse? Right. Well, and that, it's DC. Yeah, right, yeah, and and they're super into their parallel worlds right yeah, now. Yeah, Crisis on Infinite Earths. It's the only way they're going to justify mind. rebooting all of those movies. <laughs> They have to. You got. Yeah, I think in uh, it's not just a Marvel thing. I think comics in general have that multiverse mm -hmm. thing. Yeah. They've had different eras of comics. Where they rebooted like, characters throughout, and then brought old versions back. Yeah, you like just haven't you, seen it in a lot of. Like, well, if you films. didn't have that, if you didn't have that, no. Batman would have ended in the seventies. Sure. Okay. Done. Yeah. No more Batman. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Told the story. Over. His dad didn't. Well, what if again. he? We don't do what ifs. This is comic books. Mm -hmm. All right. We tell one story. End of story. Well, Marvel, that was a definite what if. The what if was a Marvel thing. Ugh. That's, yeah, that's like, they probably have a copyright on that. What if Spider-Man, <laughs> hear me out, what if Spider-Man was Banana Peel Man? And instead of having the powers of a spider, he's able to not slip on banana peels. Not slip? Yeah. He's that, he doesn't even conjure bananas, it's just that he can't slip. Yeah, he that's, won't be able to catch him slipping? Yeah, that's his ah. power. Ah. And All right. he works in a, uh, <laughs> a farmer's market. Just to, uh, where he constantly slips on banana peels to throw everyone And the off. Green Goblin. Ah, uh, yeah, so they don't catch on to him. They don't side. catch on to him. Like, ironically, they banana peels all the time. That's ironically, the Green Goblin peel, has the power to throw up banana peels. Ah. Uh, but his powers are only useless against Banana Peel Man. After gotcha. he eats the banana, like, gobbles the banana. After he eats the it. Goblin. Yeet, and then he eats he the, eats yeah. the banana. Either way, guys, I'm excited for Banana Peel Man in Teen Titans Go versus Teen Titans. Are you guys excited for it? What's your favorite version? Is it Teen Titans or the bad one? Let us know in the comments. Uh, also, make sure you check out episode it's 66, right? That's right. Episode, uh, episode 66 of Screen Source. So we're going to be talking about... It's the only episode I care about. Uh, we're going to be talking about uh, a bunch of this film and television news, so make sure you check that out, as well as all the other trailers we're going to be reacting to. And then go back in time, check out the trailers we reacted to the last time, check out Ludum Tempest, a whole bunch of other old Color Circuit videos, and, and uh, have a good time. Uh, waste a few hours. See you later.